I read the script and I was instantly drawn to the story. I mean, just the story of Star and what she goes through in the, the story. I mean, that was what really pulled me. And um, also just with the topic, you know, I think it's really important. And I think it was, uh, you know, especially with me being a part of it, I thought that I just, I had to, I had to be a part of it. I had to be a part of the story and the storytelling and um, this narrative. So, um, I mean, I'm really, I'm really stoked to be a part of it. He gets uh, shot and killed by a police officer, and uh, essentially she has to find her voice and her activism through the injustice because you know the police officer doesn't end up going to jail or all this kind of stuff. So um, you know it's it's a battle for her, and also all while living in the hood and going to a private school, she also has to you know deal with those kind of complexities that she has to deal with and kind of switching and turning on and off certain things uh, and certain things of her personality. He's really protective over her, you know? I feel like he's like a second father. Uh, I, I, I would say he's like little Mav, you know? Um, yeah, you know, he's always looking out for her best interests. You know, it's his little sister. The talk that he gives his kids at the beginning is pretty much just how to pr conduct yourself in this world, especially being black, right? Uh, you know, there's obviously some sort of, some privileges and there's some things that, you know, we can't really control. So it's really just about him educating us and how to conduct ourselves in, sp in particular uh, with the police, uh, with the, the authorities, you know, and um, just to, you know, really just be careful and, you know, kind of walk on eggshells, especially when, you know, you're, you're caught in a certain uh, situation where, you know, things can go south at any time, uh, yeah, just to just be smart, very smart. I think what she brings to this movie is just truth. You know, uh, I had a lot of time to, uh, you know, sit down with her and just get to know her, you know, and her life story. And it's freakishly odd how close it is to Star. You know, it's, it's very, very weird. You know, she came from, you know, I guess, the hood, if you would say, you know, um, and she went to a private school. Um, you know, she obviously had to deal with certain issues that were in this script in real life, you know? Um, so I think throughout the process, she really just kind of pulled from real life experience and her own truth to kind of make it real to her, you know? And, um, you know, when she was kind of just tapping into certain, you know, scenes and certain moments, I can really just see that it was really affecting her, you know, um, in real life and, you know, even off, off camera, you know, she was still affected by it, you know, we'd go back to our hotel and she'd still be affected by it, you know, and it's, it's, it was really beautiful to see, you know, and how committed she is to this role and, and star and, you know, she was telling me that, I mean, this is a dream role for her, so, you know, I'm just really happy to be a part of that. It's very rare that you see someone so com committed to his craft, you know, um, I could tell that he has theater background because of, you know, how, just his physicality, you know, uh, just setting, just preparing himself for a scene. You know, he's very, very uh, physical and he really gets into it in his body and he really just lives this, you know. And at the beginning, when I first met him, I didn't know if I was meeting Russell or if I was meeting Mad because he was in character already. So I think that is just so incredible. And um, I've learned so much from him, just working off of him and, you know, just even just being on the sidelines, just watching, watching him work. You know, it's, it's really been, uh, been an amazing experience. What I really enjoyed was uh, just how passionate about this project he is. You know, we'd kind of, you know, sometimes <laughs> when I wasn't in the scene or I was off, off, uh, off camera or whatever, I'd just kind of watch him as he's kind of getting into it and he has his monitor and he, he's really moving and he feels it in his body and I think that is so special to me, you know, to see the passion in someone and see how dedicated he is to the story, you know, and, um, you know, it's awesome. And also, just how collaborative he is. He's very, very, uh, very collaborative. And I, I love that because some directors aren't very collaborative. You know, some of them are kind of really stuck in a certain way or direction or they see a vision and, you know, can't really steer too far from that vision. I really love that he's so collaborative with his actors and his talent. And um, I mean, it's been a joy to work with him. Having her on set was awesome because, you know, you get to actually ask the person that created this entire world uh, questions, you even just about your character and some backstory and things like that, that uh, were in the book, of course, but maybe some t contextual stuff that maybe might not have been in the book, but maybe you might want to ask her. So it was awesome having her around um, and also just have her around there uh, for support. This script, this book, this entire story is just so truthful. And um, man, I just really hope that people take what we put in, if that makes sense. You know, uh, just when at the end of the movie, I really hope that, you know, it's really, it's really affected you because it affected everybody that's been a part of this project, cast and crew.